Hello everyone, so here is a problem today. In this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you're going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So why don't you use a calculator? So here is a problem. 2 divided by 2 times 2 divided by 2. So very simple problem, only 2, or no squares, cubes right here, no parentheses. So what is the answer? Of course most of you out there are like, yes I can handle this, this is basic, I can handle this problem, this is basic division, basic multiplication, and I can easily solve it and learn this stuff in the third grade, so this is really great. So right now I suggest you to choose one option, what do you think is the correct answer, and go ahead and put your answer into the comment section, it will be really interesting to check our answer in the end of the video. And I'm going to show you the correct answer here in just one minute, so it will be really interesting and we'll check our answer. Okay, so we have 2 divided by 2 times 2 divided by 2. So uh, let's start with this approach. So a lot of students solve it like that. So we have 2 divided by 2, I just rewrite it real quick, times 2 divided by 2. Yeah, a lot of students solve it like that. Okay, they see. That right here we have 2 divided by 2 in the beginning. Yeah, and they divide. Okay, 2 divided by 2 equal to 1. And right here we have the same thing. So 2 divided by 2. Okay, equal to 1. 1 times 1 equal to 1. So right now I'm, I'm not going to tell you that this is correct or not correct. Let's talk a little bit about order of operation, because obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer, right? So should we do like division first, then multiplication, or maybe the first multiply this in the middle, then divide? It will be really interesting. And I'm going to show you a correct answer. So here is the main popular order in the world, so PMDAC. All internet libraries, all scientific graph and calculator works according to PMDAC order. So let's let's try to solve it step by step according to PMDAC order. Okay. The first one is parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. We don't have any parentheses, which is really great. Next step, exponent right here. Are there any exponents, squares, cubes right here? No, I don't see any of those, which is really great as well. Then we have multiplication and division. And we need to scan, are there any multiplication and division sign right here? Yeah, I see division, multiplication, division. So this is our case, multiplication and division. So I read this problem, so 2 divided by 2 times 2 divided by, by 2. And let's solve it correctly according to PMDAC. Because a lot of students do this common mistake. They say, okay, the third step is multiplication, let's multiply it in the middle. But I, I answer them, okay, multiplication and division is one group. So we need to work as a group. Multiplication and division is one group. Yeah? So, and now we need to scan. How can we solve it correctly? Yeah? And now we need to scan what is the first sign from left to right. Okay, we'll see. The first sign is division, doesn't matter, it will be like multiplication, division, so in our case division. So let's start from this division. From left to right, we'll go from left to right, and let's start with this division. So 2 divided by 2 equal to, equal to 1, yeah? 1, and let's rewrite this expression that we have right now. So 1 times 2 divided by 2. Okay, and right now we have this expression, let's scan what is this step. So multiplication division part, once more. So let's scan what is the first sign from left to right. From left to right, the first sign is this multiplication. So let's multiply. 1 times 2 equal to 1 times 2 equal to 2. And we will have div division by 2. 2 divided by 2 equal to equal to 1. So as you can see, a really interesting tricky moment right here, because this is a correct explanation, a correct, correct solution to this problem. And we will have like 1. And this is a wrong approach to this problem, but the answer is the same, so really tricky question. If you're interested in answer, you can use both methods, but this is absolutely wrong method, and this is a correct explanation and a correct answer to this problem. So according to PMDAC, so answer, answer, this is option, as you can see, option, option A. This is option A1. So if you don't trust me, you can easily write this expression in like maybe Wolfram, maybe like scientific calculator, and you can easily check this, check this answer. And this is a correct explanation to this problem. Really interesting problem, uh, a lot of countries, a lot of approaches about it. And write your suggestion, write your question, what do you think, how, how do you solve it in your country? It would be really interesting to read about it. And of course, thank you for watching. If you don't feel, if you solve it wrong, don't feel bad, yeah? Now, if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate it. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure, thank you for your time, and have a great day.